On this episode, we take you to Chipokes Plantation State Park, a nice little campground tucked away in the backwoods of Virginia, about two hours south of Washington, D.C. There's an old plantation house, which is part of a working farm, and plenty of places to hike and take the pups for a walk. But before we do that, it's time to take a ferry ride and a road trip into Colonial Williamsburg. The ferry leaves every 15 minutes, and it's an easy ride across the James River where it lands on the opposite side at the old Jamestown settlement. There is usually a gift shop and a bathroom on board which is open to all passengers. Unfortunately, COVID kept us restricted to our cars, but they did allow us to get out and walk around. We're at the Williamsburg, what's it called? Historic. We're Colonial his, Historic Colo Colonial Williamsburg is all it is. Colonial Williamsburg, and as you can see, it's completely packed. No, this is the visitor center. This isn't Colonial Williamsburg. This is just the visitor center for it. Oh. Do you even know where you are? Not really. <laughs> so here we are at the Williamsburg shuttle bus ride, and you can see there's a very shuttle. there's a very long line to ride the shuttle, <laughs> right? It's COVID and it's only March. Could have something to do with it. Yeah, right. A bus leaves every 50 minutes from the visitor center and will take you to all the different points in downtown Colonial Williamsburg. The great thing about this bus is that it's super pup friendly and your dogs can ride as long as they're leashed. Unfortunately, our camera died. But if you're in the area, we highly recommend downtown Williamsburg as a fun, family, and pet-friendly location. The visitor center and gift shop at Chipokes Plantation is actually really cool. So if you have little kids, we recommend you check this out. There's a pathway in front of the visitor center that takes you on a short walk down to the beach, where of course, Edison and Paddington get tons of attention and we make more friends along the way. I couldn't resist the smile on his face. <laughs> oh, you got a kiss. <laughs> See? Thank you. Bye. <laughs>
short drive from the beach takes you to the old plantation manor. Once you're there, you're free to roam around the grounds thinking of what life was like in times gone by. It is worth mentioning that at some time in this history, this plantation was run with slave labor. This group of young people is looking at the old slave house, a house where families lived, lived after they worked and toiled on the farm. And they're probably thinking the same thing I am, how precious our freedom is. Eddie. After a long day of hiking and exploring, we go back to the campground, Eddie. where we rest, relax, and recharge. We spend the rest of the evening relaxing and staring into the campfire, listening to the sound of the crackling wood and the peace and quiet. And we realize just how lucky we are. And just like that, it's all over. Until next time.